First of all, adjust the selected frame correctly to your patient. Then start the measurement procedure. Place the measurement tool with both hands on the frame. Press the spring struts down and apply the four hooks around the frame edge. Once again, take off the frame with the measurement tool attached. Check if the tool is placed exactly in the middle of the frame. Check if both spring struts are aligned parallel to the face form plane. Check if the bottom retaining bars stick out vertically from the rim of the frame. Take your Visurial portable and stand in front of your patient. The optimal distance between optics and patient is 1 meter. Your patient, the device and you should be aligned. Make sure that the patient has a natural head and body posture during the measurement procedure and also aligns his line of sight and body to the optician. Ask the patient to look at you directly and to fixate the objective lens during the recording. Take the front view picture. For this, all calibration marks of the measurement tool have to be in the bright rectangle and the horizon line has to be green. Ask your patient to turn sideways by 90 degrees. Take the side view picture. Check the natural head and body posture of your patient again. Both calibration marks and the eye have to be in the bright rectangle. The horizon line has to be green. Make sure that the front spring strut covers the rear strut in the picture so that you only see the one in front. Then take the picture. When you receive the first measurement results, check if all automatically detected measuring cursors are properly positioned. If not, activate the zoom mode and move the cursors. You can find information on the correct cursor positions in the enclosed quick guide. Then upload the applied corrections. The recalculated results will be displayed by return. Email the results to your own mail account in your store. This completes the measurement procedure. There are different ways of saving the results, for example assigning them to an already existing patient file. Search for the desired patient and assign the results respectively. If you have questions regarding the different buttons, use the help function.